hello you guys welcome back to my channel today is a beautiful day the sun is shining the birds are chirping it's gonna be my updated iud video three months in hey i'm so excited because i'm really getting good with this consistency um if you don't follow my instagram channel follow my instagram my instagram channel my instagram page um it's kyra orange just like this channel I'm getting real regular. I'm pleased with myself. I can still say that. I just want to make a disclaimer first. Before I get started on the topic of this video, this is going to be um, about my IUD, about my birth control. So this is a women's health kind of thing. If you don't want to hear about my Can't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> People like to do that. Didn't warn me. I'm telling you right now. So if you haven't seen my part one, go watch my part one. I'll link it somewhere down below. Um, pretty butterfly. What was I saying? I got my IUD. I got the Kylina IUD. And she told me that there will be bleeding, spotting anywhere from three days to three months. So the first three days, as soon as I left getting my insertion, I had some bleeding. And, you know, they put a pad in you, on you, whatever. Um, you know, because it's expected, it's totally normal. So the three days go by, and I had stopped spotting, so I was like... You know, maybe I'll be one of those lucky people that only, you know, have that for three days because um, cramping was, wasn't bad either, but it wasn't there. So after three days, you know. But, <laughs> I mean, first few days, as far as the bleeding goes, it was, you know, really, like, small spotting, but my cramps got bad. And I was like, oh my god, like, I never felt cramps like this before. Maybe I have, maybe I'm exaggerating, but like, it had been a long time. I don't know, it felt like, you know, like when you first get your period, I don't know. I, my cramps are pretty bad when I was first getting my period. I was kind of freaking out. It was that bad. Like, is it supposed to be cramping that bad? I thought about calling them, but I was like, let me just, you know, wait it out. I'll see. Whatever, they were pretty bad. They went away after, I don't know, I'll say like five, six days, okay? And, you know, my bleeding stopped too, so probably for about three weeks. So I'll fast forward about three weeks in a month, and everything was going fine. I had my period. Um, it was longer than usual, but... Um, it wasn't like a heavy flow or anything. It was pretty normal flow, but I feel like I was bleeding about eight days. And there was no clear end. And I was, so, you know how you, the end of your period looks? My, it didn't really do that. It was like, I don't know, like some weird version of my period. But it was my period, it came when it was supposed to come. So I was like, you know, whatever, fine. That's when it started, about, you know, every three weeks, I would have my period. So the next three weeks, I had my period, and I started spotting, and I didn't stop. So this is my second period, I'm, you know, about two months in. So I was spotting for about a month before we get to the point where I am now, and, like, everything pretty much just stopped and went back to normal. Um, I totally forget about my IUD. It's been um, three months and about a week. I checked my IUD strings before I started this video, and they are there. Uh, and interest, they say, like, you should check them, you know, every after the first three months, you should check it. And I haven't checked them since I first checked them when I first got it see how this is and anticipate it and like I already knew things were going to be changing down there so I didn't want to add like you know another person into the mix plus like I'm single and like it's not even worth the trouble looking at honestly but yeah um I will say about my strings the first 
three, like when I first checked and when I first got it, I could feel them like a lot easier than I can now, three months after insertion. And they tell you um, when they put it in, she told me like um, your strings will like shrink up a little. So, um, you know, don't worry about the length of them because they're super long when they first put them in. Well, like when you hold out the little, well, if you guys go watch my first. Guys, can watch my part one. I'll link it somewhere down below. Um, oh my god, I have to fly out. Go away! Rude! Um, what was I saying? Oh, my part one. Guys, go watch my part one. I'll link it down below. But I have like, um, like one, like a device that they use just to like show you like you know what it looks like and what it is before they literally put it in you so she showed me and i'm pretty sure they clipped the strings because they were like i don't know in my mind they were like this long when she put them in and i feel like they're about this long now because i was like really searching for them <laughs> but yeah um i'll be sure to let you guys know when i check my new strings out and i'll tell you for this. I am so lucky, you guys, to be this soul and this body at this time, at this exact place. Oh my god! I'm so lucky and I'm so excited, so grateful. Um, my hormonal acne, I did have some hormonal acne in the beginning, but it's all gone now. I don't have a single hormonal pimple. And... And I'm prone to those. I do have hormonal acne. So maybe it's cleaned it up a little bit. I don't know. Keep an eye out for that. But yeah. All in all, I would totally recommend this to, um, to any girl who wants to go on breast control. Um, I've had good experiences. And I'm not someone who um, does good with breast control. I had the pose before and I was like, oh, no. what else? oh, I had the depot shot. The depot shot might have been fine, except I only got one and you need to get it every three months. I didn't go back and get another one <laughs> because the first three months was so terrible. I bled every single day for three months. I was spotting and I would not recommend the depot shot. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave some comments below. Are you thinking about getting an IUD? What um, brand are you thinking about going with? What's the link that you want to do? If this video helped you at all in your birth control journey, thought process, give it a thumbs up. And yeah. Alrighty, that's gonna be 